Hi, I'm Jennifer Ennister with Lighthearted. Emerald is the Pantone color of the year. I'm a sucker for statement necklaces, so today I'm going to show you how to make this rosette necklace and a few other ways of how you can incorporate the emerald color into your everyday look. Step 1. Cut a strip of fabric about 1.5 inches wide and about 20 inches long. This makes a rosette about 1.5 inches in diameter. The longer the fabric, the bigger the rosette. Step 2. Tie a knot at one end. If there's excess, trim off close to the knot. Step 3. Tuck the knot back onto itself and begin to roll the fabric around it, folding and twisting the fabric strip in towards the center of the rosette. Use a small dab of glue every now and then to secure the fabric twist. Keep folding and twisting in circles. Step 4. When you have a rosette of desired size, leave about one inch of fabric at the end and twist to underneath the rosette and secure with glue. For the rosette that's been attached to the large gold hoop, loop the ends through the hoop and secure fabric strip with glue to the back of the rosette. Step 5. Once you have the amount of rosettes you want, arrange them on a piece of paper and create a pattern by drawing an outline of your rosettes. Cut out the pattern. Step 6. Trace the pattern onto felt and cut out along the inside of the edges. Step 7. Dab glue underneath your rosettes and press them heavily into the felt. Step 8. Attach your chain. So instead of doing a necklace, maybe do a pair of shoes or a belt in the emerald and that'll really give a pop of color to your outfit. Also, emeralds trending really big right now in beauty products. So consider something like Sephora's line, which is actually the Pantone emerald color, in an eyeliner. Using it with just a fresh face kind of gives you that trend, but not too over the top. Also, um, I love the nail color, the green and the nail color. This one's my favorite right now, which is the Essie Going Incognito. Um, so if emerald isn't your thing, there's a lot of other shades of green that are also trending this season. Consider something like a pistachio or mint color, which is huge in the bridal world right now, or even going kind of more not as bright, like a camo color, like an army green. Um, but whatever the trend is, make sure you're comfortable with it. Figure out what works for you in order to incorporate it into your everyday look. So make sure you subscribe to my channel for weekly videos every Friday.